Hello and welcome to the PageRage video tutorial. Today we will be showing you how to create title bars with text when using the PageRage Create Your Own Layout tool, or for short, the CYOL tool. Please keep in mind that in order to use the PageRage CYOL tool, you will need to have the PageRage browser plugin installed, and you will need to have created a PageRage user account in order to save your layout creations. You can install the plugin on www.pagerage.com as well as sign up for free for a user account. So once you have installed the plugin and you have created a user account, you will now to need to have access to some type of editing tool like Picasa or Photoshop. We will be using Photoshop in this particular video tutorial. So once you are in Photoshop, like so, click the file option in the left hand corner and once your drop down menu appears, select new. You will name this new template title bar. And the width of the template should be 1020 pixels by 80 pixels in height. This is the correct measurement for all page rage title bars when creating a layout. So once you have filled in all that information, you will now click OK. And now you have a title bar template and we will add color to the template which is pretty easy to do so to do that you will click on the box in the left hand bottom um, corner for color choice which is right here and it's already highlighted in black which I want for my template but you can choose any of these colors within the color wheel as you see here so once you have a color selected just click OK and um, Next, you will need to choose the gradient tool to apply the color onto the template. So the gradient tool is right here. And once you have that selected, you will now click and drag your cursor across the template, like so. And you can do this as many times as you want to get to the desired color. So once you have reached your desired color, you can now add text to the template. To add text, you will click on the horizontal type tool icon and place your cursor within the template where you would like your text placed. And type some type of text. And now you can edit your text as you wish by double clicking on the text layer in the uh, layer console. And once you have it highlighted, you have the option of changing the style of the text and changing the size as well as changing the color. So as soon as you're finished editing your text, you'll just go back to the arrow cursor right here. And you can move your text just to make it look a little bit more even on your title bar template. And if you don't have any other changes to make to your template and you just want to save, you will go to File and Save for Web and Devices. Click Save and just save it to your desktop. So once you have it saved, you can now go back to pagerage.com and log into your user account. Click Layouts, and we'll be creating a new custom layout. And now we can upload our newly created title bar image, which you see right here. And you can decide to change the color of the text if you wish. And once you are finished creating your new layout, click Save and Publish. And as you know, you can name your layout, categorize your layout, add keywords, description. And if you want to share online on the PageRage website itself, you can submit to Public Gallery. So that about wraps it up for today. Stay tuned for new upcoming video tutorials on how to create custom curtains using Photoshop and the PageRage CYOL tool. And don't forget to visit our YouTube channel for more PageRage video tutorials at www.youtube.com backslash PageRage tutorials. Thank you for tuning in.